It was, uh, I got an email from, I wish I could remember who it was, saying, hey, you've got to check out one of my favorite Valley musicians. He's been playing at the Alvestone. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah. Got some gigs in the I, area. Uh, I play the Alvestone every Friday and Saturday. Great. Great. Um, yeah. It's a great spot. Yeah. I was very, uh, I shouldn't say I was too surprised, but I was pleasantly surprised to uh, catch some of your YouTube stuff and see what you've been doing. Can you tell me a little bit about how long you've been playing and how you how you got into the, the style, sound yeah. you, you play in um, now? So I've been... Uh, Playing since, uh, well, forever, but I started formal lessons when I was about eight or nine, and uh, uh, I made up a little song, and uh, my teacher said, oh, that sounds kind of like blues, and uh, so made me a mix CD, and uh, that was the first time I really heard all that stuff, um, and uh, it just really connected with me. I, I, uh, I was like that. There it is. I was. I've been like looking for CDs of like my dad's to bring to my teacher to like learn <laughs> songs and find me stuff like I sort of like this or like this. And then I heard that mix and I was like, that's what I want. And uh, yeah, so I've just been doing it since then and uh, sort of flowing through the different styles within blues and uh, for you know at times liking the more electric stuff. And uh, but lately it's just been. Uh, I've just been trying to hone in on the, getting my acoustic sound and uh, sort of mixing it with some folky, some bluegrassy, some country, all that. Um, but um, yeah, definitely come from a lot of blues um, listening. Great. I was. I'm glad you mentioned that because I was going to ask about that. Uh, the, the style of blues and sort of the hard. Where you find the heart in that? You know, I, I feel like some. There's a lot of great acts in the area and uh, elsewhere that have uh, this sort of blues sort of thumbprint that ends up on some songs is sort of blues influence and then there's much more traditional blues artists too that's really exactly what they want to do these very more traditional sounds uh, so I, I was curious about that but it sounds like it's kind of both for you there's this pretty traditional heart to a lot of what you play and then some some sort of uh, jumping around genres from there is that yeah. fair to say yeah it's uh, yeah. a good way to put it. <laughs> I gotta ask where that guitar came from. Where that? Uh, this guitar actually yeah, was a gift from my dad. Yeah. I, uh, um, yeah, I don't, um, think he probably ordered it online or something, but uh, <laughs> came in a box. Um, and uh, uh, <coughs> for the first uh, few months of having it, I, uh, I said I tuned it up to standard tuning and you know played around. It didn't feel great, and I just d didn't play it for a while. And uh, but then I, I don't know what spurred it, but I just took it out and put it in uh, like an open D or something and uh, started playing a slide on it and uh, and I sort of realized, oh, that's that's more of this guitar. And uh, so, yeah, I just, I, I bring it to all my acoustic gigs because everybody also comments on it like this, you know, and that sort of gets some attention. Uh, but yeah, it's... Uh, so yeah, it's a good one. Great. Yeah. And are you, tell us just a little bit about what you're playing tonight. Is this a mix of original yeah, stuff? So <coughs> um, I'm going to do uh, a couple uh, couple sort of more traditional songs and a couple uh, couple of my own. All right, great. We really appreciate you being here. This is a good yeah, thanks for having me. chance to let us admire that guitar and, uh, yeah. and check it out. And like you said, you're at the Alba Stone on a regular basis. So. Yeah, every Friday, Saturday, unless otherwise noted. Um, I'm there. All right. Um, yeah, playing this stuff. Uh, yeah. And you live in the area too. Is that yeah. Um, right now in Haydenville. Right. Um, but yeah, grew up, grew up pretty much in Northampton. Cool. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you, Eli. I really appreciate yeah, you being I here. Appreciate it. Thank you. It's all yours to, for whatever you want to do. One more round of applause for Eli Cowan.